Intelligent machining. Intelligent machining is used to increase efficiency when milling. Two tools are chosen at the same time, and the tool with the larger diameter will be chosen for milling for the first round, and the tool with the smaller diameter will be used in milling for the second round so that the areas which are not milled by the larger tool can be milled. But by using a tool with the larger diameter, the machining speed can be greatly improved. And by using the tool with the smaller diameter, more accurate machining can be achieved. Select your graphics. Now go to Toolpath, Intelligent Machining. Here you will select two tools. To change the tool, simply go to Remove Tool, and then Add Tool, and select the one you wish to use. Set your parameters here. You can choose raster or offset. Set your total depth to 5. Set side allowance at 0. And choose overlap ratio of 35%. Multi-layer engraving is not needed as we are only milling one layer. And we will select anti-clockwise contour. Click OK. And you can see that there are two toolpaths which have been formed. The larger one is done with the tool with the larger diameter to clear the areas. And the smaller tool is used to cut the areas which have not been milled in the first round. Select both toolpaths. Go to Toolpaths Shaded Simulation. And you can see the rough sketching by the larger tool and the finishing off by the second smaller tool. And this will increase and this will improve the machining speed greatly. Now go to Toolpath. Toolpath Output. And as you can see, they are both area clearance, so you can choose to save them both under the same file. Under General CNC, Click Save. And that is the end of this tutorial. Thank you.